Saga regarding Christian Horner's Red Bull future continues to rage on with the teaser. If I have released a statement regarding the internal investigation into Christian Horner, insisting that they remain committed to upholding the highest standards of integrity, fairness and inclusivity within motorsport, the Red Bull team principal was placed under an internal investigation following allegations of misconduct from a female Red Bull employee. Although the decision was made not to suspend Horner from his duties, offering their comment on the matter, an FIA statement read, in relation to the independent investigation currently being undertaken by Red Bull GmbH, the FIA reiterates that until such time as the investigation has concluded and the outcome is known, we will not be commenting further. The FIA remains committed to upholding the highest standards of integrity, fairness and inclusivity within the sport. Despite the uncertainty regarding his future, the Red Bull team principal was present at the RB20 launch event at the team's Milton Keynes factory last Thursday, and he also plans to be present when preseason testing gets underway in Bahrain on Wednesday. There is currently no given time frame for when Red Bull expects the internal investigation to be concluded, although according to Sky Sports News reporter Craig Slater, Horner could be left waiting until around the first race of the season at the end of February. When asked about his future at the RB20 launch event, Horner was defined, stating, Look, I'm absolutely committed to this team. I've been here since the beginning. I built this team. There's been highs and lows along the way as you've seen in some of the videos that you've seen earlier. We've won 113 races. We've won seven Drivers World Championships. We've won six Constructors World Championships in 19 seasons. And that's in the history books now, but it's what lies ahead that's always important. Yeah. So my focus is on the future is on Red Bull powertrains becoming operating a startup engine business.